I'm hoping my phone lasts until I get home tonight, which my plane will land at midnight, but I'll probably film on the way to the airport talking with Nate, saying goodbye to Nate. He's my best friend. Um, and maybe a little bit at the airport. I don't know how it's gonna go, but I um, appreciate you guys watching through this Alaska trip. And I'm excited for the trips to come. But yeah, just stay tuned and we'll see how getting to the airport is and hanging out at the airport for a couple hours. We'll check out and see what the lounge is looking like these days. Hey guys, so my best friend Nate's right here and um, we'll flip you around sure what you're seeing real quick um but we if you didn't catch where this we were an intro to your um talking about the show that you watch on tv about ted stevens no departures yep, yep right on. so uh we are at the airport i'm going home i know sad um but here it's we not are that big of an like, i don't know if you could really see because my view is kind of flip crappy. it that way i am do you not see anything garbage footage it's gonna be garbage footage it's okay we're flying i'm flying alaska i'm flying out of alaska i'm going home but the great news is nate is i'm gonna be back in a month yep and well actually you're gonna be in oregon before i'm back to alaska because he has four weeks and three days or something like that until his marriage yay yay um and then they're going on a honeymoon and i'm coming up and hanging out with Laylee while they're doing what they're doing so yeah, super fun. I'm going to end it here um, so I can say my goodbyes to Nate. Um, why don't you go close to Alaska? Alaska's good. This is Alaska. Yeah, I guess. What do you mean you guess it is Alaska? I always go up to Bedore number three. Well, this way, oh, it's handicap. It doesn't matter. Nobody's going to do it in here. All right. I love you. I love you, too. We always park in Alaska handicap parking. <laughs> no, we do not. Just pull forward and we'll be past it. I just, I need a second to get out and not shit my pants. <laughs> or if she does shed her pants, I promise I'll get the footage. <laughs> We're so fucked up. Anyway, so I'm going to say my goodbyes, go in. Um, I got a couple hours to kill, but we'll be she hanging out. She hang out in the lodge. In the Film lounge. the lodge. Oh Not the God, lodge, the, the lounge. I got chicken all in my, almost in my pants. All right. Just say goodbye to Nate. Bye, guys. You'll see him in a month. Hey, so, um, let's see, the last time you guys saw me, Nate was dropping me off, um, ended up dropping me off, and then I immediately I called him, and I sat outside of, um, the security line talking to him for 30 minutes. That just kind of shows what kind of friendship we have. Um, we're getting close to 30 years now, and we still have a lot to talk about. Um, one of my best, like, not one of. He is my best friend. Um, I do got other friends other than Nate. I know he's mostly Jesse, Nate, and my sisters. Um, but I do I have some other friends out there. Um, I'm ending up in the lounge. I got uh, about two and a half hours to kill before my flight. Um, I did have to go to the airport early just be with like scheduling conflicts. Um, so right now I'm just hanging out in the lounge. Um, I got like a little meat tray thing because we did stop and got um, uh, Raisin Cane's Cane's. Raising canes, race, race, race some canes, raising canes, I think, um, before, so I'm not too hungry, but I will, um, I think she said that we have, um, pancakes and soup, um, available, so, and then of course, like, pre-packaged snack type food, so, we'll see how it goes, um, not too hungry, but I think right before I get on a flight, I might eat just a little bit, because then I'm not gonna get home until, midnight tomorrow or not tomorrow but yeah essentially yeah tomorrow um i got the gopro set up out the window catching i i am my father's kid his favorite thing was to watch planes take off um and, and he would take us to watch him and stuff so i'm gonna sit here and just kind of watch the runway i'm actually kind of at a bad angle because where i'm at right now is just kind of just where they're being taxied off at um, the other end of the lounge looked a little busy, and so I kind of came to the far end. And I, by far end, I mean I'm at the, there's one more place. But they have these uh, cubicles up, and then 
also cards telling you whether your seat's been clean or not. Also kind of reminds me of like buffet cards, you know, like the Brazilian buffet. <laughs> I'm such a fatty, I'm a foodie. I mean, fatty foodie, whatever, same thing. Um, but yeah, like green means bring me more food, red means I'm slowing down. Nate will get a joke. Fat friends forever. FFF. Okay. Um, don't know where I'm gonna, because I pan out, I think I'm gonna watch some TV or play some games, how I decided. I downloaded a book, Audible, that thing I'm gonna listen to on the plane, but I might start it up now to see if I can get into it. And then that way when I'm on the plane, I'll be really into it. <laughs> So they started boarding. Um, I'm kind of letting like <laughs> I ate so much of that soup. I was I stuffed my face. That soup was so good. Um, so I'm kind of letting them do their general boarding. Um, I am flying first, so I could get on. Um, but I'm waiting to do so. Um, just have more time to like be standing and let my food digest before I have to sit for a four-hour flight. Um, and then I'm going to get on, um, <clears throat> really enjoyed my time in first class. I hope you could hear me. If not, you're just seeing my mask suck in and out. <laughs> um, but yeah, let's we'll say goodbye to Anchorage over here. Um, the line is probably one, two, three, four, ten deep in like the last section of general boarding. And then I'll, um, get on, I'll let them go through really feel like I need to like walk and try to burp or something but no anchor has been good and I'll be back in a
Hey guys, so I landed in Seattle. Um, it was actually a pretty quick flight. Um, pilot said that we caught some good tailwind or something along those lines. Um, just taking a breather. All right, sorry if you get too much of sports in here. I don't know what's on. Anyway, I'm in Seattle. I got about um, 20 minutes until I take off. So, anyway, um, yeah, the flight was pretty good. Coming in, it kind of felt like a student driver, you know, like that gas break, gas break, and they can't figure it out. That was kind of like the turbulence coming in. It was like, we're going in, felt a little fast, and a good amount of turbulence. But, um, all in all, it was a good, good flight. Uh, it ended up being a little, like, uh, first class ended up being pretty busy when I, uh, looked at the, the seats and stuff, like, the day before when I checked in. Not all the seats were taken, and, uh, when I got on the plane, it definitely was, um, but my seat mate was nice. Um, y'all know how it is. Anyway, so, say about a good two hours and I should be home. I'm gonna get off here. Um, and give my mom a call so she'll know when to leave McMinnville to come get me up in Portland. Super easy, uh, really foggy and cloudy coming in, so I did not get a landing um, time lapse. But it looks like coming out of Anchorage that it's going to be really pretty. Although I don't think uh, the camera could catch how vibrant and how red the sky is. Um, one thing I know about the few times I've flown in and out of Anchorage is that the sunsets were, have always been so gorgeous and so nice um, every time. In the summertime when I flew in, I was chasing that sunset the whole time. The sun never actually really set, but um, I'll throw in a picture from uh, the summertime versus wintertime so you can kind of have a general idea of um, what I'm talking about, but man, it was a pretty one. Um, tonight, so yeah, I'm gonna just kick back, relax, uh, maybe walk around for a couple minutes before I have um, just like a little pedal jumper down to Oregon. Um, I think it's about a 50 minute flight, so it's not that big of a deal. Um, but yeah, thanks for thanks for traveling with me, guys. It's been real fun. Um, I'm gonna be doing it again in a month, so um, stay tuned and and we'll see what uh, between now and and the wedding and coming back up to Anchorage. Sorry, my hands getting tired for holding my tripod. And um, so I get a little shaky. Anyway, yeah, just, I don't know what's gonna happen between now and then. Um, if anything, my video might just be back in Anchorage, who knows? Um, but I, I have a feeling that um, come March is gonna be a lot of fun, yeah. Hey, 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 hey. Hey everyone, if you haven't noticed, I'm with my family. <laughs> and, uh, and, and, and mom asked me to drive home, which I did say if she picked me up, I will try my best to drive home. So I made it, my flight um, in Seattle was delayed. And, um, but you know what? I made a pretty decent time for as late as it was delayed. So I'm gonna go home, it's been a fun trip. Thanks for hanging out with me. And um, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye -bye. Bye -bye.